Hey guys, welcome to another episode of English Thai Hoi. My name is Ben and I hope you guys are doing great today. This video is going to be the first follow along video in the series that I'm going to make. I am basically going to be talking about different types of topics and I will explain to you how you can use this video at the end of this clip to improve your spoken English. And I am going to talk about Chinese New Year celebrations because Chinese New Year is just around the corner. It's actually two days away. And on this very special occasion, you can expect to see this little red envelope everywhere. In Thai or in Chinese rather, it's called Ang Bao. This is Song Ang Bao. In English, it's called Red Envelope. Well, since this is an envelope and it is red, that's why it is called Red Envelope. The name just doesn't get any fancier than that. And when I was a child, I used to receive a lot of red envelopes from my parents and my relatives because I am part Chinese. But as I grew older, or you can say when I got my first job, they actually stopped giving me red envelopes because I was already making my own money. And the money received in the red envelope is considered to be lucky money. So when you receive these red envelopes from people, you will also receive the blessings. How are you guys going to celebrate Chinese New Year? I'm actually planning to go to Yawarat or Chinatown to get some um, delicious Chinese street food. And I will probably later give my family the, this little red envelope as well. If you're watching this video on Facebook, you can download it to your smartphone and listen to it on the go. Listen to it three to five times and you will be able to talk about Ang Bao and Chinese New Year to your fellow friend like I did. And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to click like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you have any comments or suggestions, you can leave them down below in the comment sections. Until I see you guys again, practice makes perfect.